The undefeated Lebanon boys varsity basketball team played a Division II quarterfinal game at home against Sauhegan on March 12th in their quest to reach the Final Four for a fourth year in a row. Lebanon's scoring started slow but built a 14-point lead midway through the second quarter before the Raider offense started to click. Lebanon held a 10-point lead at halftime. Sauhegan was able to close the gap to just five points before the Raiders went on a 13-0 run to close out the quarter. Lebanon continued to score in the fourth and led by as many as 20 points midway through the last quarter. With the game in hand, the starters came out and Lebanon went on to win 59-36. K.J. Maddy, number 13, led the scoring with 15 points. After the game, coach Keith Maddy talked about the quarterfinal game and his hopes for the semifinal game on Wednesday. Yeah, I think we, um, you know, we had an uncharacteristically sloppy first half offensively, but I'm really proud of the way the kids defended the first half. That kept us, you know, enabled us to get the lead, and we try not to worry about how we shoot it. And, uh, you know, Jake Hansen and Matt Island have both had great first halves and great third quarters where they were able to keep us uh, afloat until the ball started to fall for some of our perimeter shooters. So I was really, I was really pleased with the way the game went in terms of our effort level and the way we defended. And then, you know, I was happy with the way we shot it in the second half, but we don't. We we try not to worry about how we shoot. There we go. So, and uh, these, these guys work really hard. They deserve to be in the picture. They, uh, I'm so proud of my seniors, too. This is their fourth consecutive year of being in the Final Four, and people have no idea how hard they've worked or all the, the time they, they put in. So I'm so proud and happy for them. And we look forward to getting down to Durham's on Wednesday at 6. And uh, like I said, we haven't been to the finals yet in this four-year run, and we're really looking to finish the job this year and get to the finals. Good luck to the Raiders moving forward. Now we should note that this will be our next game of the week with a special premiere Thursday night on WYCU at 8 p.m. Now tomorrow night we'll have highlights from the D2 Girls Championship game featuring Hanover. And on Wednesday evening we'll have highlights from the D3 Boys Championship game featuring Kearsarge. We've got a loaded week for you so stay tuned.